Hello, welcome back to Ngatech Solutions. So, in this video, we are going to see on how we can uh, insert values into Ngatech uh, table. Let's see, for example, select star from Ngatech. You see that it is an empty set. If you describe Ngatech, so we are going to see that this is totally empty. Now let's insert values into this uh, table. That take. So the insert the value into a table, use the insert command. You have the insert into table name, which is in that take. Then you can add the columns in which you want to insert this value to. But since you want to insert to all the columns, no need of specifying a particular column. So insert into Ngatech values, open bracket, and close. We the first one is going to be the first name. So it should be uh it should be in quotes. The first name is Gabi, last name is going to be Nga. Then we have the age to be 23, and then the contact number will be 68650186592. That is my own uh, contact number, but only call. Well, let's see. Okay, so if you see that I have actually used this one, the contact number I've put in quotes, whereas the age I've not put in quotes. So if you put it, either you put it or you don't put, it's still okay. You won't have any problem. Let's run this and see. So you see, we have one role affected. So if you select it now, start. Select star from Ngatech. We see that we have now one row which have been inserted. Now, on that question in which one of uh, one of my students asked me is that how can one insert multiple uh, values at the same time? So the way you can do that is by simply going using the insert value. Insert value where we have values. I'm just going to repeat the same value. Remove this uh, semicolon and then give put a comma instead. And then you open another bracket, open and close. Then you give it the next column. In the first name, just say, for example, Sido. Uh, then the last name to be Vivian. Then we have the age to be 25. And the contact number, let's just do some values. Then if you press and uh, if you give the semicolon, wherever the semicolon comes in that square, you are telling, saying that this is the end of your statement. So you can run. Once you run, it's that the two rows have been affected. So that's the same thing that you can do. You can still do it this way. If you remove this semicolon, you put a comma and then press enter. Just simply continue putting in your values. Let's say, for example, the first name again it can be Duba. Then the last name, we'll give it 
data and the h can be 27 and the contact number is those are just some uh, numbers i'm just imaginary numbers i'm giving so it's not calling okay so but the first one you can try it that's my direct line which you can receive calls but not at night so once that is done you close the semicolon and we press enter so you have three rows that have been inserted you also have to be given a one here we have three duplicates zero one in one is one so duplicate is zero then we have one in one so we select star from oh select star from Gatek yes so these are the uh, values that we have inserted so this is how you can insert values into a table as well as insert multiple values at one into a particular table thank you very much this will be the end of this session see you in our next video and don't forget to subscribe